Let's first draw a free body diagram. Since we are neglecting the thickness of the gate, we can ignore all the horizontal forces that go through point C, since it won't create a moment. We just need to focus on the forces perpendicular to the gate. So now we can look at force FA. Let's assume a moment in the clockwise direction to be positive. You can pick the opposite, but I like clockwise to be positive. Now we can write the vertical force like this, focusing only on the y component. Again, we don't need to worry about the x component of force FA. Next, we can look at force FB. As before, taking clockwise to be positive, we can focus on the y component using the sine function. Since this force is pushing upwards, we can see that it will in fact rotate the gate counterclockwise, which means our answer will be negative since we assumed clockwise to be positive. To see which way the gate will turn when both forces are applied, we just need to figure out which moment is bigger. From our numbers, we can see that the moment created by force FB is bigger, so the gate will turn counterclockwise. I hope this helped, and if it did, please give a thumbs up. Thanks.